today. We'll show you one skill for every position on the field. One skill that is commonly used by players in that position. And just for the record, in this video we're talking about attacking skills, even for the defensive positions. You're watching All Attack. Goalkeeper, fake kick. When you're a goalkeeper who's looking to play a pass, but a striker from the other team is moving quickly to block the ball. Fake like you're going to do a big clearance upfield, then drag the ball past your opponent. Now, normally as a goalkeeper, you probably shouldn't dribble in front of your own goal. But if you've already taken a touch out to the side and you really think the attacker might block your pass, then it might actually be best to give them a fake. Fullback, the roll across. When you're a fullback, receiving a ball to your feet, and an attacker is closing you down, move as if you were going to take a touch in field. But instead, let the ball roll across your body and touch the ball down the wing. If you are going to try this skill, just make sure that the pass will actually get to you before your opponent can intercept it. Because if the pass is really slow, then waiting for it will basically just give the attacker the ball. Center back, long passing. In the modern game, to be considered a great center back, you have to do more than just defend. You have to be able to pass the ball out of the back and start attacking plays. Now, to be an effective passer as a central defender, one skill you'll need is the ability to pass the ball long with speed and accuracy. And to do that, you'll need to master the driven pass technique where you use the top of your foot and strike the lower half of the ball. This will allow you to play the ball out wide to your winger or fullback without the ball being intercepted. Defensive midfield, outside turn away. When you're dribbling in the middle of the field and defenders start to close you down, use the outside of your foot to stop the ball, then turn away from pressure. When you're a defensive midfielder and you're on the ball, one of your main jobs is to not lose possession in dangerous positions. So that's why it's important to turn away from situations where you're probably going to lose the ball. Attacking midfield, Meg passes. When you want to play the ball to a teammate making a run, but a defender is blocking the angle you want to pass the ball at. You may still be able to play the pass 
if you put the ball through the defender's legs. Also, if you can't find a gap in the defender's legs, sometimes you can create one by taking a quick touch to the side before passing. Winger, the Matthews. When you're on the wing, in a 1v1 situation, use the inside of your foot to start dragging the ball down the line. Then, bring that foot around the ball and use the outside of that same foot to cut the ball in field. This skill is really effective because it makes it really easy to go different directions. If the defender takes the fake, you cut in field. And if the defender doesn't take the fake, just continue down the line straight past them. Striker, chest pass. When a ball is coming to you from high in the air, and you have a teammate nearby ready to run onto the pass, Use the area between your shoulder and your chest to hit the ball to your teammate. Moving your shoulder in the direction you want to pass. As a striker, you'll receive all kinds of high lofted balls. And sometimes, rather than bring the ball down with your feet, it's easier just to pass the ball with your chest. All right, everyone, we hope you liked that video. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up down below, make sure to subscribe, and make sure to check out our other videos if you want to learn more about football.